We now return to Sin City 3000. I almost forgot what I was playing. I don't know why. Uh, okay, first things first. Before any other thought enters my head, because I continually forget about it, we're going to put down that damned lighthouse. Lighthouse. And I'm going to put it right here, at the edge. I have not found any indication. Put it down first. 5,000. Wow, okay. Uh, any indication that this has any impact on the whirlpools or anything like that. It would be nice if it did mitigate that. And if I knew that, like it was, it would mitigate it in the area, then I would definitely put it like right here or something to protect that bridge. Um, it just seems to be a thing. Uh, it does raise the cap on commercial, I want to say. Um, so yes, we'll have that at least. And then let's put... Uh, I guess we can put a playground park next to it. Sure. Okay. Uh, next. So, like, this little island, right, I was thinking about putting that lighthouse there, but there is, in fact, a landmark we can do... Um... Well, the Statue of Liberty is in here somewhere. I'll have to look for it. Um... Okay. Also, whilst we're in here, exciting news, uh, I was watching a video, someone else's video, uh, playing this, doing a bunch of weird stuff, but I noticed that they had a lot of landmark buildings that I didn't know about, like, uh, for example, the Stonehenge Pantheon, the Moai, and then that weird thing that I just was looking at, uh, the Simville test module, Dealy do. And I looked it up, and apparently there, at some point, had been an official... Uh, Maxis expansion pack to this. I will put a link in the description for it, but it adds a whole bunch of new landmarks and it also seems to duplicate a few of these. Um, but yeah, so that's kind of exciting. I might find a way to put these in at some point. We can maybe put the Moai down maybe by the bridge or something as protection. Uh, but a whole, a whole new bunch of stuff for me to think about. Like this Risenrod thing. Um, maybe if I do have like because there there is a landmark eventually that we'll get or a reward for like a theme park and then I can put this next to it or something start creating some fun things and then there's like there's this really weird teacup house thing like they they have a lot of them and it's like it looks like some kind of tourist trap deal but I don't know man it's it's weird that's tiny <laughs> anyway uh, we don't need to do any of that just yet. We're going to put down the Statue of Liberty on that that island. But not right now. What we're going to do right now is expand our farms. So, let's, let's see. I think I'll put a crossover right about here. And before that, mm, I did kind of go through some money. But before that, I think I'm also going to take care of the last remaining pocket of fire over here. So I, I looked and I uh, plotted, and right here should be a good spot for that. Bam. Almost, almost perfect. So we do have a little bit of triangles, but for now, most of the city is now under fire protection. So that's good. Right, so I think I think it was here. Uh, well, well, let's see. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. So the road will now go there, and then we're gonna have a, a hook up there. And I think what I'll actually do is I'll just go ahead and fix some of the land right up to here, right up to there. Okay. And. Uh, I don't know, pull that back. Okay. So now we can get that going. Hmm. You know what, though? If I want to put a farm right here, and I kind of do, uh, that's not the place to do it. Let me see. Let me see. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. That's that's not five at all. It's four. So there'd be one there, and then if we came back one, uh, right there. So we got a gap. So if we go the whole way there, uh, 
See, I could put trees here, so maybe if I just scoop it back one, because then we go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, the dead tree there. So yeah, if I just scoop that back, go right up on the hill. Perfect. Alrighty. It's 40, but we're going all the way over to that tree. Visually making certain of that. There's that one. There's that one. And that gives me a little pocket down here to do some weird stuff with. For now, that should work. Make sure we're not watered in this area. We are not. We are definitely powered here, though. And this will allow me to make a connection eventually over to here. Let's go ahead and hook this up. Check my money. Now, I don't know if that's too close, so we're about to find out. Get rid of you. Hmm. Do that. No, no, you're not playing along here. Don't do that. There we go. All right. So now let's put in another one. First of all, we're going to want to make my barriers. As per usual. And let's see, that means one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So we have to flatten that hill. Where does... The road... Okay. So we're actually fine, but I'd have to jank it in there. One, two, three, four, one, two, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Oh, so this actually creates, so this would be where the road would have to be, which is not aligned with that, but that could be okay. Um, how would I handle this? I guess maybe just fill in with trees and fake another orchard. Okay, blah, blah. Uh, one, two, three, four, two, three, four. So it's really just going to clip <coughs> that uh, that hill there. So if I see now, that's oh shit, wrong one. Ah, the angles. <laughs> One to be four, one to be four. Gotta go down one more anyhow. Wait, is that? Now it's flat. But now we've worked that. Hmm. All right, that should be good to go. Take industrial. Right, 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 right. <laughs> Getting ahead of myself here. God, this is dumb. I'm taking too much of my own money out of this. Okay. I feel like I'm falling into a trap here. Similar to my Theo Town Let's Play, where I'm just building farms all the time. Uh, you should be powered. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Play ball here, come on. Son of a... There you go. Just gotta push it a little bit. Shopping cart parade staged. First to celebrate commercial development. Yay, yeah, yay. Yeah. To celebrate first commercial development. Commercial zone develops. You're becoming a big city. First, medium density commercial building. Oh, okay. Uh, which would be down here? Where did I put that? Well, that doesn't matter. We do see, though, that we've absolutely killed demand <laughs> because some of these buildings are going abandoned, which is not good. So I need to start packing people in here again, which I guess means we will be building our residential and maybe maybe build a little 
pocket up here. Anyway, I gotta handle the farms again, so I will be right back. Okay, so I took the liberty of just adding one more here, um, just to, to get that done out of the way. Added this in as a fake orchard over here, whatever. It, uh, it is complete now. And now we've absolutely tanked demand. So now it's time to slow you down power plants at max capacity again. Is that true this time? Uh, I argue there's still about a thousand megawatts tucked away in there. I don't know how to handle this anymore. Uh, we do need to move away from here, though, because I kind of want to start using that spot. So, uh, given that this is all connected to the grid now, and I don't plan to build over here for quite some time, I think I'll just build a power plant out here. This time, why don't we go a little bit more than a gas power plant, because this is really taking its toll here. Oh boy. Oh boy. we got to go cheap. We gotta go cheap, unfortunately. So I'm just gonna plunk you down there. And then we're gonna Let's see. Power power would connect to the rest of the city from over here, so let's go. Well actually it should it should connect just being next to that farm. And we have created quite the snafu along here. What the hell? Pretty bad. Pretty bad. Oh yes. Uh, now we're probably far enough away I could afford to start watering some of these places. But until I can do all of it, it really doesn't serve a purpose because they're still going to be screaming at me about stuff. So let's uh, let's go ahead and start getting more of these in. Um, the power. Yeah. That is not powered. Okay. I might want to keep that going though, so this is subject to change. But for now. I, I definitely think I'm going to want to keep that going. I guess we can just do a corner piece here, and then I can just... Come out, or, or maybe I can corner piece it here? Let's just do this now. Nope. Like that, and then I guess something like that. That is hideous. That's really bad. Let's not do that. What about... Here. No. Okay. Fine. Fine, fine. Uh, and that leaves me a little corner to build on anyway, so... I, whatever. Um... Right. Okay. Well, uh... I guess, I guess both residentials. And we'll just, uh... Let's see. We do have a little bit of commercial. Why don't we plop a little, maybe put a strip of commercial up top here, ah, right, this thing that I constantly ignore, let's do a little light, in there, let's do, not that, a pond, here, and we'll just tuck a few houses back here because we can. Um, maybe a few along here, too. I don't know what I'll put right there. But it seems like there's a little 2x2 two two spot that could go have something. Unless we want to maybe make an apartment there? Sure. I think originally I'd planned on putting the commercial here and then having a 4x4, four four, but then I put parking lots so that it uh, looked nicer. these. Dead gardens. Okay. We'll, uh, put in a strip there. Cool, cool. Alright. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll do some smattering of commercial out here. I don't want to do a full commercial block just yet. Um, so let's do... Let's get this in here. I mean, that would actually be a great place for a park.
Another thousand bucks? What's another thousand bucks? Why not? Ah. Afford to get rid of that now. Playground. The playground there. Even on both sides. Let's grab light residential. And ah, screw it. Let's just go the whole nine yards here. These damn dead trees. We'll go all the way and spend everything we got. Put a park there, pond. We're kind of... You know what, another playground, why not? So is this one... It is a 10 by 10. Okay, it doesn't look like it's centered, but I guess it is. More light. We ready to go? Five thousand? Bam. Potential little commercial stop. Hey now, hey now, come on. What are you complaining about? up. Now, okay, it just had to tick over a little bit. Okay, that's a thing. Uh, we're now full capacity there. Ah, right. This time actually is a water situation uh, with these people. So, we're not going to do farms anymore here, so let's go ahead and continue that. Now we could actually extend it. Here, though, here we're still going to need farms. But on this side, maybe not. What are you? Let's see. We'll, we'll loop it here, even though we don't need to. That's fakery, so it doesn't matter. not watered. Huh? Oh. Probably because we're out of water. Uh, and I meant to do this, too. I replaced this long ago before the crash, and then I never replaced it in the new timeline. But we're probably going to want an extra one anyhow. And now we need to stop spending for a while, because I am out of money. So we'll let this run, and we'll see what happens. Boy! A little spot right there that I could put a couple things. Like park and fountain, but it's kind of a waste to put that out here. There's nothing here. Let's check on the traffic. It might be possible to put a bus stop there without eating my demand. But I also don't really know that. Interesting. Interesting that that would go down now that people are using it as well. Or maybe they're not. Maybe now it's simulation has diverted all the, the work traffic. People are driving here instead of taking the train. I mean, look at this. People are driving everywhere. And that is absolutely hurting on the pollution front. That driving. 
here though like it really really pokes around the uh, the train stations not something that I was anticipating hoping that we could actually use the train stations to advantage, but maybe having them along here is actually gonna gonna hurt me. That's okay. Uh, as long as it doesn't hurt the actual ones, like this one's gonna be a fake one pretty much anyway. Once I run the highway through here, that's actually... See, that's another thing I was thinking about too. Like, th the highway, how much pollution is that gonna do? And it might start uh, affecting things. Turn off your lights and conserve power. Someday we'll flick the light switch and the light won't be on. Ordinance is complete foolishness. Spending money to tell people to turn off their lights, indeed. Perhaps we should tell them to breathe as well, or eat. Well, you might be wrong about this, though, sir. Um, residential repeal the clean ordinance, clean air ordinance. Uh, I agree with this group. Industry is important, and this ordinance is making it more difficult. And necessary, it might even be scaring away new industries. Uh, no. Tourist promotion university awarded is with great honor that we announce uh, the gift of a university. Our high standards and excellence in education, blah, blah, blah. Good. We got that now. Aerospace tax incentive. We should do everything we can to attract aerospace companies. This is a non-polluting industry. Are you sure about that? And can provide high-tech jobs to our workforce. A tax subsidy is a powerful form of persuasion. This would give a distinct advantage to non-polluting aerospace companies and probably entice a few of them to locate here, but offering such an advantage causes a great deal of money. Walkers do not pollute the air either. Should we give incentives to all walkers? How much does that cost? Uh, yeah, that is rather pricey. I mean, eventually we're going to probably want to put more or less all of them. I mean, electronics jobs fair, tourist promotion, industrial pollutant, you know, like all of these things need to be, be done eventually. Maybe not some of these. Subsidized mass transit is probably a good idea. Reduces traffic congestion and air pollution. Uh, it's provide, provided based on our population, so who knows what it would add right now. Uh, I mean, the budget just never seems to go up. And I think it's largely because I, I'm still putting in light residential. Once we start putting in higher densities, we're going to see a little bit of a shift. We do have some more industrial, again. Um, so maybe I should make good on my idea here. No ships have been saved. That'll probably be the next whirlpool thing. Uh, make good on my idea and add a little industrial down here. Um, although, man, we still have not been able to, to squash the polluting industries, despite just exceedingly high EQ. And now, now that I've put in the extra library and museum, even the old people are making it. What we're not doing, though, is keeping people alive for very long. Like, they immediately drop off still. So we still have ordinances to put into place for that. But I think, you know, we should probably do... We should probably do the thing for the pollution, because that is actually hurting. Um, and, I, man, I do want to put in a zoo. That'll also increase our caps. Man, that's 5,000 bucks. Let's put in our industry. Let's start gaining a little bit more tax. Because I also want to do a seaport. And then we just need to sit for a bit, I think. Um, okay. So this is going to go inward five. From the road. So there'll just be a little pocket back here. But we can, we can afford to get rid of some of this. Put light... Five. Is we'll go the whole way. Okay. And then we'll uh, we'll leave some of that. I don't know that this is a great idea considering what is right next to this with high land value. Oh. 
When I, I, oh, it's just going to be, if we ever have another bridge disaster, I'm just going to reload. I'm just saying it now, because this is, once we have a seaport here and all that, it is going to be so much harder to level the land and make this happen again. It's not good. Uh, oh, well, that's probably because I just put it in. So let's, let's let it go. Huh? Are we still out of water? There's a whole area that's not being watered. We're maxed out. Hot damn. I think I do need to uh, to come in and uh, re rethink what I'm doing with, with this. Because <clears throat> right now I keep getting that message that everyone's left out of the rain and I just ignore it. But, you know, we might actually have real crises like this and uh, not good. Now I know it has to be right next to it. But does Kitty Corner work? In SimCity 2000 it was good enough. Now this has to be up there. Okay. Yes, we're gonna have a water issue here pretty darn soon, I'm sure. Um, North, please, thank you. One solution to that would be a desalinization plant, like right here along the ocean and then just feeding that into industry cutting it apart one thing I also need to do and I uh, how much is that water treatment plant 15 grand yeah we're not gonna do that anytime soon we need to save up for a lot a lot a lot that? A little blue spark here? Chamber of Commerce upset over taxes. Aren't you all? I mean, I suppose I could. I could lower taxes by one on each. You have just a little demand of commercial. So I think I'm going to go ahead and put that in. Tax incentive could bring aerospace. Okay, yeah, yeah. I mean, I suppose we should probably do that. We need, we need you. Let's not do that one there. In fact, let's go ahead and small part. We could do that. Try and increase our, our industries. Alright. You, ignore. Lack of smoke detectors cause for alarm. In the interest of public safety, we want you to enact mandatory smoke detector ordinance. Did I not? Proven use of smoke detectors lowers, lowers flammability. Less flammability means fewer fires. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we haven't done it. We, we haven't had a fire yet. Is that not there? Nah, here it is. Only minus six. Plus the neighborhood watch. Alright, the big old crossing guards thing. Did I ignored and left. Man, can we just can we just take a moment and, and, and not spend money for just a little bit? Hmm. Why are you having issues? The road is right there. I guess because rail counts as one and then there's that. So okay. Yeah 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 that makes sense. 
It's not within any kind of range. What is your land value like? Very low. Oh, yeah, God, look at this. This was a medium. This was medium, and we turned it into low. <laughs> we got that right next to it. Yeah. I mean, I, I knew that was going to be a thing. Not powered. Interesting. Well, ah, geez. All right. Let's, um... Should I just continue filling in the valley over here? I feel like yes. I feel like we need to to keep sections of the city together that are already infrastructured and everything. So let's build another block. Five and five and eleven. So. Do we maybe... What do we have over here? Nothing. Okay. Play grounding. Right there. Hmm. I think we should continue with this idea of uh, little apartments smattered around. residential everywhere else. You have to be mindful of the neighborhood, you know. Don't want to do full-on densities yet. This is still sort of old town suburbia over here. Oh, there's just a little, a little tick. Of course there is. I'm still not sure if I want to build up on the hill. There is, uh, like, an importance of green space, too, just for, like, overall uh, aura and aesthetic. Um, so, like, I had thought about doing a diagonal road on the hill and just doing that because land values and also maybe proximity to water, but it might just be nice to have that as a buffer, like a barrier hill or something that I could cover in trees or something. I don't know. Uh, we got a little... 3x3 three three spot here for something. Let's do one more. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, that, uh, that's nice. Don't want that. It's going to be an awkward hill here. Come in, new pond. Let's just and the same. Maybe go a little deeper on it. not realize the city in the middle of a flight path. Uh, path. People are going to love that. Um, I mean, now we're getting... Well, okay, no. Look, we're, we're close enough to, to trains on both sides. That should be enough, right? We shouldn't have to put a bus stop in here. I would hope. Alright, let her rip. Hmm. Come on, take over. There you go. Just to zoom out, make sure. Okay, this one, ooh, light blue? Does that mean, does that mean not quite? Better check. Mm, it's getting there. I think it's elevation, because if you look, all the lower elevation is light blue. 
So we don't have to worry too much there. Yeah, man, I'm upset about this. But... Okay, why don't we, as last act here, let's talk to my advisors. Parking fines drive citizens mad. Downright unsimly going about downtown to spend your hard-earned money, plop in the car in a spot, and come back to find a parking ticket. How do you feel about this? The complaint is specious. If the honorable representative didn't plop the car in a place where it doesn't belong, there'd be no parking fine. Yeah, uh, no, I think this is fine. Um, if we kill a little bit of demand, fine. It encourages Sims to use the mass transit system, and that is expensive. You know what? I want to see something real quick. I haven't been checking my mayoral rating for a while. I wonder if decisions like that do have an impact. Uh, unemployment approval rating. That's reasonably high, I suppose. And I mean, we see no dip or anything like that, so it's fine. Um, yeah, overall, pretty good. Let's check out the eggs on my house. Ten. It's gone down from eleven, so we should be doing okay, I guess. How are you? Still high level. High level, good. Seventeen thousand. Cool, cool. We need that to be much higher so I can start putting in more stuff, though. Um, we're at how much now? 58? Okay. I wanted to do this... Subsidized mass transit. Let's just see how much that's gonna cost. That was the one, right? Reduces traffic congestion and air pollution, yes. Man caught shoplifting spatulas. Thousands of flippers found in bedroom. Can we see anything about this? Well, the traffic, air traffic is light. I wonder when it gets worse. Plenty of schools, scholarship on the rise. Yeah, we should have some of the smartest people ever after a while here. Getting pretty high in that. I think I think maybe we should do the tax incentive. God, that wiped out almost a thousand. Not costing me anything. What the hell? We just lost a thousand bucks. Somewhere. Maybe even though this isn't at capacity, I should just put one in anyway. A new college. I mean, it's not screaming at me to do so. Sims may be smarter than you are. Remarkable, isn't it, Mayor Gaz? Sims in Solar City are smarter than I ever could have imagined they could become. Well, hey, <laughs> what are you saying about people? Our education levels are literally off the scale. It's all due to your belief in the importance of education. Thanks to you, we now have the most highly educated... Ah, oh, shit. Um, why didn't you warn me about that? Uh, a highly educated workforce in the region. Just what clean, high-tech industries are looking for. If only they would start coming. I guess we're going to have to incentivize them a little bit. Okay, well, uh, we've... <laughs> we've nipped that idea in the bud then, huh? The idea that the, uh, the lighthouse stops this from happening? But then again, it might be proximity. Maybe, maybe it went way over here because, you know, that's not, uh near the area. How many did you save? Nobody. See, so like, if it happens in this area, does it save? Sorry, it, uh, it, it just sounded like UFOs in my ears for a minute there. I guess not. Okay. Whirlpool wishy-washy after all. Left as quickly as it came. Um, cool. How is, how is traffic? But we have, we have cleared the traffic along here, I am pleased to say. 326 people. So we have not killed any... There's a bus. We have not killed any, uh, any demand in our trains by putting bus stations down, so that's very good. 
Very good. Lots of parking lots around here, though. I don't like that. Medium land value, so... Eh, well, what do I know? Uh, right, we got room for sports parks and other, other stuff. So yes, I would like to... Uh, I would like to eventually get that damn seaport in here. Crime is too high. What? Neighborhood watch programs demanded. I mean, this would be a good idea, I suppose. Strongly support this ordinance. The police can better serve Solar City when the neighborhood comes in, becomes involved in its own affairs. It's money well spent. Yes, money spent, though. <laughs> That's the thing. It's all costing me money. Water conservation would probably be a great idea, uh, given how much I'm constantly having to pick up on that. Um, let's see. Uh, neighborhood watch, mandatory smoke. I mean, yeah, that'd be a great idea. Youth curfew is not necessary at the moment. Backyard composting. Chemical ban. What's that do? Uh, contaminates groundwater, although the chemical ban hinders agricultural development. Uh, most sims believe the reduction in water pollution is for the greater good. Okay, but we haven't even put in a filter yet. Treatment plant, so I'm not sure that's necessary. But, uh, yeah, this aerospace and that electronics... God, that's 35 extra. That's, um, that's a lot. That's a lot. <laughs> I guess our budget could probably handle it, though. Not if I start lowering taxes. I still maintain we don't need to, but maybe we should anyway. So, I mentioned a while back that, like, if you put it to 0%, like, right now, our population is in the next bracket. So, if I lowered all tax to 0, that would increase growth by 15%. And I believe it is staggered beyond that. So, like, if we... If I lowered it a little bit, you know, it, it would still increase the percentage by a, by a, a little bit. Um, so right now, we're, we're looking at 7. Everybody wants to be at 7. But if I lowered it down to 6, it uh, looks like I would increase by 8%? That, well, that's at 0. 200,000 at 0. 50, 50k would be 15% at 0. So, who knows what, but, uh, you know, it might be worth looking at. But I, I still... I don't know. That there is something to be said for lowering the tax so that you gain demand, so that you get more money in the long term uh, than you would otherwise get from the tax, but uh, we, we seem to be okay with balancing that as it is anyway. Wow, we're getting some nice plazas over here. Uh, we need money. <laughs> we need money so I can start putting down things. Ooh, that that little thing disappeared. How's the library? Good enough, I guess. The station's good. Schools are still good. Good, good, good. Oh, full developments, redevelopments over here. Okay, well, uh, you know, we're just chugging along, as always. But I think, uh, yeah, we're going to have to address this at some point. The whole pollution thing with a highway ripping right through there might actually not be ideal uh, at all. But we do still have some demands, so I think I can start you know, filling in some of the gaps before we do major construction projects. But I think it's once we get down here and I start putting density in, then we're really going to start seeing this kick over. I mean, we're getting medium land values already. Um, what is Aura like? Aura is really damn good over here. Aura is getting fantastic over here. They love farms. Um, but yeah, like once once land value starts kicking into high gear, I think that once we combine that with density, then we'll start having the tax revenue that won't won't uh, trouble me ever again. Hopefully. How is the energy? See, even with a new plant out here, we're still... When's the next power plant? 1980? 1980? We're 1980. Do we have wind generators? Not yet. Oh, yes we do. Right there. Windmill. 
Okay. Oh god, is that the next mega project? Building a wind farm to rival nuclear power? I could do it. I don't really... I mean, I could. I, I do have 20,000. But then there's also the additional cost of raising land high enough that I could build it. But we could do it. And then not have to worry... I mean, I could build half of that. 10, ten grand for an 8,000 megawatt would still be better producing than anything else here. So uh, now that we got this, maybe maybe we'll start doing clean energy and start getting rid of this crap. I'll have to calculate how much energy I'm currently using and how much I'd have to make up for it. And that's going to be the trade-off, I'm afraid. Do we start using hills? Like This is a nice flat hill and this would be a great spot for a, a block with a lake in it and then try to do high density. Try and make some money there. But there are other options. I mean, really, I should just do this. Just raise up another level of hill here until it's maxed out. Again, that's going to cost money. Always money. How are you doing? It's still grade A, but I think we could probably afford another museum to, uh, to increase that longevity. Now, longevity, though... What can we do about that? We just need lifespan to go further, and I guess pollution, lowering pollution is one way to do that. Ah, whatever. Anyway, I need to end this one here, so I will see you next time.